discretion is advised. Here's what we're going So we got some nice new updates on the DCU Warner Brothers video game side. So this comes from Warner Brothers Gamers. Looking further, the studio has a single player open world game, Wonder Woman in development. I was wondering like what the hell happened to that Wonder Woman game? Like we haven't seen anything since what? When, when was that teaser? 2020, 2021? It's been a hot minute, bro. So I'm glad that they're still working on that Wonder Woman game because we haven't seen jack shit. As well as uh, games that will be canonical additions to James Gunn and Peter Saffron's DC Universe reboot. Let's go. <laughs> A very consistent message coming from the executive layer of Warner Brothers of Warner Brothers Discovery is the importance of franchises, Haddad said. There is a unique and important role games have in keeping our franchises relevant, resonant, and exciting because there's plenty of fans and plenty of people consuming content where games are their starting point. It's their performed it, it's their preferred form of content and i love this because you know what this means we are finally on the verge of getting a superman game a superman game that fans have been salivating and waiting for since the dawn of time bro we've never 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 had a great superman game and now is the time to get a great superman game especially in the form of david corn sweat which dcu games going forward they will be uh, connect, you know, uh, canon to what James Gunn is doing with the DC Universe. So, I'm super excited about this. I think this is a great idea, and I'm glad that they're really starting this off. Um, we can possibly get another Batman Arkham game, uh, just retooled for the DCU. We we could get a Flash game, a Justice League game, obviously the Wonder Woman game that's being developed right now, uh, Green Lantern game. Like the, like there's so many possibilities, and that's this is this is what I love. Like I don't know why in the past DC. Uh, or the executives over at DC did not take advantage of this. Like, use the medium at your disposal. You own this shit. Where, where are the great comic books? Where are the great video games? The great movies? Like, put this at, at your disposal and make it all canon. And if it doesn't work, fine. It, it doesn't work. But at least try. And, that, and that's what Peter Saffron and James Gunn are doing. They're trying to see if this will work. And if this works, and if they pull it off... Bro, like, again, like, this is going to be the dawn of a new era, the dawn of great DC video games, the dawn of a great Superman game, and it's all under the supervision of people who care about the product, who care about the content, not just not just James Gunn and Peter Saffron, but David Zaslav and, and the executives at Warner Brothers who want to make sure that the DC brand is beloved and that they put out great quality content and not only, you know, in every space of the medium, which is comics, movies, and video games, etc. And this is a great jumping off point. I cannot wait, bro. Ugh. Like I, I like just imagine a Superman game for the PS5 or the or the, or the PS6 whenever that shit comes out. Bro, it, it, it's going to be amazing. It's going to be amazing. Cannot wait for this shit. It's about damn time, too. So that's going to be it. Hit like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Discord, TikTok. This is Ash Cheeks. And let me know in the comments below. What do you think of this news? Are you excited? What DC video games do you want to see moving forward? Love you all. Stay safe. Truth out. Possible homosexual. Must investigate further. <laughs>